The Mexican tetra has two forms, surface fish that have eyes and can see, and cave fish that lack external eyes and are blind. Purebred cave fish are always blind, even if you raise them in the light. We've discovered that the offspring of two blind cave fish from different caves can see. This video reveals how we know this. We test vision of month-old fry by placing them in a small dish at the bottom of a cup with black and white stripes on its inside. If the animal can see, its eyes follow the stripes when the cup is rotated, and then they snap back. If it can't see, its eyes don't follow the stripes. This is the apparatus we use. In the clips that follow, we look at surface fish, cave fish, and intercave hybrids. Look for eye movements that slowly follow, then quickly snap back. This is a surface fish with large eyes. You can see that several times its eyes follow the clockwise rotating stripes and then snap back. It has good vision and can see the stripes. This is a cave fish from Tinaha Cave. Its eyes are smaller than the eyes of surface fish. Its eyes don't follow the motion of the stripes, in fact are motionless. It is totally blind. This is a cave fish from Molino Cave. Molino Cave is geographically distant from Tinaha Cave. Molino Cave fish also have small eyes. You can see the movement of the stripes reflected in the bubble, but the fish can't. Its eyes don't move. It is also totally blind. The final clip shows a hybrid between fish from Molino and Tinaha Caves. Both of its parents were blind, as were their ancestors for countless generations before. Note that this fish has eyes larger than those of the pure cave fish, although not as large as those from surface fish. It certainly isn't blind. Its eyes follow the stripes and snap back, just as with the surface fish. These experiments, and many others like them, show that vision can be restored in cave fish if you make the right genetic crosses. To learn more about this exciting research, you can read the original scientific report, which can be found at the URL shown.